The 2024 Porsche Taycan Cross Turismo might look like a station wagon, but it's really an EV dragster with the agility of a sports car. The Cross Turismo shares powertrain options with its sedan sibling, minus a rear drive model. The long roof Taycan's electric powertrains range from the mild 469 horsepower S and medium 562 horsepower 4S to the spicy 616 horsepower turbo and blazing 750 horsepower turbo S variants. The wagon's cabin mirrors the tech-focused and high-class interior of its sedan counterpart but adds additional passenger room and increased cargo space. Max driving range is an EPA-estimated 235 miles, but based on our range testing of the sedan, Porsche EVs tend to be more efficient in real-world driving. The Taycan Cross Turismo and Sport Turismo enter the 2024 model year without significant changes. Both models' infotainment systems earn native Spotify integration, as well as finally incorporating wireless Android Auto. The two variants also gain Porsche's variable light control panoramic sunroof, which uses an electrical current to diffuse incoming light, working as a sort of built-in sunshade. The price of the 2024 Porsche Taycan Cross Turismo starts at $103.550 and goes up to $199.150 depending on the trim and options. The Cross Turismo lineup aligns with the regular Taycan, except that there's no rear-wheel drive model and prices for the wagon are slightly more expensive than the sedan. With that said, we'd recommend the Cross Turismo 4S model, which features a 562 HP powertrain. As with all models, it comes standard with all-wheel drive and an adjustable air suspension. The Long Roof Taycan goes on sale this summer and comes with a free 3 years of Electrify America charging. We'd also recommend taking advantage of the Porsche Experience Center for an extra, albeit worth it, sum. Naturally, the Taycan Cross Turismo is motivated exclusively by electricity and shares a chassis and other components with its sedan counterpart. However, the wagon is only offered with all-wheel drive. Power is supplied by two electric motors with total outputs ranging between 469 and 750 horses, depending on the trim level. One of the most interesting elements of the Taycan is its two-speed transmission on the rear axle, a first for an EV. In our testing, it helped the Taycan Turbo S rocket to 60 mph in 2.4 seconds, making it one of the quickest cars we've ever tested. The 562 HP 4S model made the leap to 60 mph in 3.5 seconds. What's more, unlike normal EVs, which get slower as their battery charge depletes, the Taycan provides consistent performance. Our first drive of the 469 HP Taycan Cross Turismo 4 showed off its expedient acceleration, agile handling, and reassuring brakes. The Taycan 4 Cross Turismo provides the most range with an EPA-rated 235 miles. Both the Taycan GTS and Turbo Cross Turismo aren't far behind in their federal estimates at 233 miles. Unsurprisingly, the high-output Turbo S has the least range, traveling an EPA-rated 222 miles between.